Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can apply paragraph formatting to a text containing object when it is in object mode to apply your formatting changes to all of the text within the object. Note that some paragraph formatting options such as the increase indent and decrease indent buttons will not be available in this mode. To display all paragraph options, click into the text within the object to place it into text edit mode and then select only the paragraphs that you want to format. After selecting the paragraphs, click the buttons that appear in the paragraph button group on the home tab in the ribbon to apply your paragraph formatting. You can hold your mouse pointer over each button within this button group to see a screen tip that shows the name and function of each button. Some buttons, such as the bullets button, have small drop-down arrows on them that will allow you to select a choice from a drop-down menu that appears. Other buttons, such as Align Text Left and Increase Indent, are simply buttons that apply or remove the formatting specified by the button. You can click the Paragraph Dialog Box Launcher in the lower right corner of the Paragraph button group to open the Paragraph Dialog Box where you can set the properties of selected paragraphs. In the General section, you can use the drop-down to select your desired paragraph alignment. In the indentation section, you can use the spinners and drop downs to set the entire paragraph indentation or set special paragraph indentation, such as a first line indent or hanging indent. In the spacing section, you can set the amount of spacing to apply before and after paragraphs by using the before and after spinners. You can also use the line spacing drop down and spinner to set line spacing for the selected paragraphs. After setting the paragraph formatting, click the OK button to apply it. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.